When we first introduced Magic Bullet Film, we had a pretty simplistic grain engine in it, and that was just purely based on performance. We just wanted film to be a real-time tool. Computers have gotten a lot faster these days, and in between there, we've created the VFX uh, suite, and we were just really studying a lot about grain. And so we created this tool called Renoiser, which is secretly the greatest grain emulation tool out there and we're doing a terrible job of letting people know that so um, what i would do is i would take the grain <laughs> of these tools and uh, and reduce it and go here to uh, renoiser and throw that on there at the end because the grain that you get is just so much more beautiful the renoiser grain engine is just magic i'll pick a really uh, extreme example here so here's a super 8 uh, film stock or even if I were to pick like 16 millimeter preset, you can see that it's not just overlaying a layer of grain on top of the image. It's actually pushing the pixels around. It's actually kind of rebuilding the image out of virtual grain. So if I pick something like Modern 35, it's nice and subtle, but it still just has this texture. In fact, we have a control for that. We have a texture uh, control and it's just at 50% here, but if I increase it, um, I'm going to get even more of that kind of stirring up of the pixels from the uh, the virtual grain simulation there.